So what are the symptoms that are associated with having an abdominal aortic aneurysm? Well, the unfortunate part is that abdominal aortic aneurysms generally cause no symptoms whatsoever until they're about to rupture. This is why it's very important to screen for aneurysms in patients who are at a higher risk for, for forming them. Um, but certainly if you have a new onset of back pain or belly pain, particularly if you have a known uh, abdominal aortic aneurysm, it may represent an expanding uh, or a leaking aneurysm that is at high risk for having rupture. So family history is very important um, in the development of an abdominal aortic aneurysm. Uh, patients who have a, a first degree family member, either either a parent or a sibling, um, will have an increased risk of developing an, an abdominal aortic aneurysm. And in fact, that is one of the uh, criteria that Medicare allows for screening for abdominal aortic aneurysms is a, is a family history of a first degree relative.